Hey guys, I'm Rayanne. I'm going to do my first unboxing of a Sephora Play Box today. So typically what my channel has been as of so far is a lot of horror movie reviews and uh, a lot of live streams involving horror movies. But I've always said, as I am a licensed cosmetologist and just a huge fan of makeup, I did want to incorporate this into my channel. So I figured, you know, why not? just bust into it with this. So the Sephora Playbox, for those who don't know, is a $10 monthly subscription box. It is, I have some notes. It has five items that are curated specifically for the person ordering it. So not everyone gets the same thing as everyone else. So maybe say you have oily skin, you might not get the same foundation if that's the thing going on as someone with the dry skin or someone that has acne concerns. It is five items, uh, including skincare, makeup, hair, sometimes perfume, sometimes I've gotten sunblock. I suppose that would be considered skincare. It all does come in a really, really cute collectible bag. I freaking love these bags. They're so cute. They're so handy when it comes for travel. I like to put my extensions in them and then forget that I put my extensions in them and think that I'm just reaching into a bag of spiders and you know that's always exciting. Uh, Playbox does come with a little uh, insert that has tips and tricks, some information about the product if you're not familiar with it, kind of what step it would fall in your makeup routine. Say you're really new to makeup or you've just never used a primer. It would give you a little info about it. It would give you info about probably the most active ingredients in it. Just in case maybe you have a silicone allergy so you're made aware of that. Because I don't actually remember if there's options when you're picking out, you know, skin type, hair type, that sort of thing. If there's an option, if you can put that you have any allergies or maybe if your preference leans towards cruelty free or vegan. So that is something to consider. Maybe find someone that you know likes the same kind of products as you do just in case there is something you can't use. Uh, the Play Pass also comes with a little insert and with your um, Beauty Insider card, you do get 50 extra points when you go into store and purchase something with this card and you can get a free one-on-one -on -one tutorial with one of the beautiful employees in Sephora to show you maybe, hey, I got this in my play box. I'm not quite sure how to use it. Can you help me out? They'll hook you up. They'll hook you up regardless. They're really cool there. So the there is also web links in the um, insert that will give you a little more information about the products and sometimes they do include some video tutorials, which is always helpful. I know I'm a really visual learner, so I really appreciate that. And the sign up, you would go to Sephora.com, follow the links to get to the Playbox subscription, and then again, just fill out the, the little questionnaire that they give you so they can more suitably tailor the products that they pick and send to you. So I have my box right here. I haven't looked in it yet, and it's been killing me, but I did cut it open just so it would be easier and I wouldn't have to struggle with a pair of scissors in the front of the camera. So I'm going to open it now. And the insert promptly fell on the floor, so you just give me one second here. I'm not going to look at that till we actually go into the box, but there's the box for you. There's the adorable little bag. And usually they have a really cute saying on them, and I'm kind of bummed that this would be the time that I'm going to make a video and they don't have one. So they are typically drawstring, which is awesome. Again, really cool for travel. Really, really cute. It's white. It's going to get destroyed in my bags, but that's all right. So I'm going to blindly pull out some products here. So this is the first thing. The Briagio Roscaro Blow Dry Protectant and Heat Protectant Creme. So that is completely blown out. You can't see anything, but there you go. So this is the hair product. It says no sulfates, no silicones, no parabens. So that's awesome. You don't really want that stuff in your hair. So there's our first one. That's number one. So as I am, like I said, I'm a cosmetologist. I sometimes 
wish that there was an option to not get any hair products in this because I can go to Cosmoprof or Beauty Centric and get my own stuff. So I don't really... But I mean, I guess it is cool if you just want to try something out. So here's the next product. Ooh, it is the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush. This stuff, I don't know if you can see it, but this stuff is really, really good. I do have this in a full size. This is the color Party. This is nice because I don't feel like it ever really fades. Like sometimes blush can kind of disappear over the day do a finger swatch that you're probably not going to be able to see because I know it's not like the most ideal lighting in here but we're going to work with what we have so finger swatches are also generally just like not that great but there it is I like that I'm really glad that this came with a blush because I was going to buy a blush yesterday because I have the the Amazonian Tarte one in like the red 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 one because I'm very fair and I feel like that was a good decision because it's pretty and I like it. And I'm really like I have a lot of red undertones. So it's it's natural on me. This next product we have here. Hold that guy up for y'all. I don't know if you can see it. But this is the Coors Wild Rose. So I am visually impaired if this just takes me a minute to read. So don't judge. Um... Oh, here we go. Ultra concentrated vitamin C oil. Oh, that's awesome. So this would be something you would use under moisturizer after you tone. I'm really, really big into skincare. I love skincare. I will spend a lot of money on skincare because that's where you should be spending your money. And then you should also, you know, take really good care of your skin because that is the, honestly, that's, that's what is going to make or break your makeup look anyways and you want to take care of your skin for the future because you only get one skin gross I mean you don't only get one but you want to take care of it so that's like a pretty decent size with this kind of stuff you don't want to put a lot on because depending I mean it does say it's an oil so it could get greasy even with serums you don't want to put a lot a lot on a lot, a lot on you don't want to overdo it, but I'm super excited to try that. I, I tend to get really sad when I like the products that Sephora sends me and then I find out how much they cost and it breaks my heart because I, I really enjoy them. This next product we have here is a lipstick. This packaging is really cute. It looks kind of like a nice clear day. It is Tarte. I'm a big fan of Tarte. I cannot read what color it is but I super like Tarte that's the second Tarte product isn't it yeah second Tarte product in this play box so there is the color that's a really pretty nude and that is definitely my MO I love nudes I'm a huge fan of nudes I typically don't wear a lot of like lipstick as much as I wear a lot of liquid lipsticks if I wear it because with my jobs two jobs one I do hair the other one I'm a medical assistant so I don't typically get a lot of time to retouch or check my lipstick to make sure that you don't have that butthole thing going on so liquid lipsticks are just easier but I'm really excited this color is really pretty the formula feels really nice and creamy Let's see if you guys can see that it's pretty. It's kind of, you know, more like a pink toned nude, but I definitely dig it and I'm really, really excited to try that out. So what do we have next here? Cat's doing some weird stuff in the back. This looks like it's from Alginist. Looks like more skincare. So I'm definitely here for that. So that I'm um, still having, a, it's hard to read the writing on a clear bottle. So I'll definitely refer to the little insert to see what that is. But skincare, I'm, I'm totally down. I'm into it. And our last item here is more skincare. So I'm super stoked. 
There we go. Now you can actually read it. So this is Biosance. I'm totally pronouncing that wrong, but that's okay. It says squalene and probiotic gel moisturizer hydrates, brightens, and balances skin. So I'm really excited to try that. I feel like their little trial samples of skincare are super, super handy, and they do give you like a decent amount. It looks like this is uh, three milliliters about. You do get a decent amount. It does give you a little feel for the product. So it is a gel moisturizer, which I love that formula. I have really oily skin, so I always feel like the gel kind of works a little bit better with soaking in especially you know in the morning when you do your makeup and you're getting ready sometimes I feel like with my skin in particular because I am so oily I know I'm going to get way more oily as the day goes on as I'm running around so it just I feel like it sits so nicely under my makeup and then here's the insert here this is the card that you would take to your Sephora to redeem your points your 50 insider points and this is good until August 31st of this year. It is July 15th right now. So here's the insert. Crooked AF. Pull back a little bit here. So this is just uh, talking about Beauty Blender more of the good stuff through Sephora gives you some oh I think it's about juicing that's pretty cool so it's telling you what you can add kind of, okay it's like a cocktail so what you can add to your skincare to help you uh, hydrate keep on water keep on water keep water in your skin more effectively with uh, the hyaluronic acid, vitamin E. I think more people need to know about skincare because you get so many reviews about how awesome a product works. You get so many reviews about how terrible a product works, but you don't really get so many reviews like, okay, well, if you use this skincare in conjunction with it, it's going to make everything better. And vitamin C serums are incredible and they're so just, they don't get enough you know kudos to them because they're so awesome and I I've been using vitamin C serums for a very long time and cannot speak highly enough about them they're so 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 good so and then here's the other side to the insert I'm giving a little more information about the products so I'm just gonna take a peek at uh, it says about the tart how to apply why it's good so this little dropper guy here that I couldn't quite read the writing on is bounce back. It is liquid collagen, vegan collagen based serum that visibly restores skin suppleness and resilience. So that's awesome. Why it's got the goods naturally source microalgae oil beads penetrate skin in an anti-aging formula that visibly reduces the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. You can't get better than that. So I'm interested to see how that works out. I've heard some conflicting information about anything involving putting collagen onto your skin versus actually taking collagen. I do take collagen supplements and the difference between before I started it and where I am now is significantly large, like very big improvement. And then I've heard a lot of people say that's the only way you can really introduce the collagen back in to get the skin and hair benefits. It doesn't really do too much when you just put it onto your skin. However, you know, your skin does absorb your skin. That's what it does. So why wouldn't it work? But I, I'm not a scientist, so I can't really comment on that. And the lipstick from Tarte is the Marine Streak. The Color Splash Lipstick Rainforest of the Sea Collection in Salt Life. That is so cute. The benefits for that are it's awesome and it looks cute. And we have the vitamin C active brightening oil. So obviously the vitamin C is a, it provides antioxidant protection against free radicals. 
which free radicals, they're all around you all day, every day. So you want to be careful about that. Um, the Briagio, let's see, it's infused with rosehip, argan, and coconut oils, which are very good. Oh, it protects against UV rays and free radicals heat up to 425, which is typically the heat you should use for all of your heat styling tools. You don't want to go too hot and sizzle, and also you don't want to go too low and just keep making passes and damaging as well. So that's, you know, that's a fine line there. Kind of just want to be careful as you can with your heat styling. So with all these products, I feel like I haven't gotten a blush sample as of yet. So I'm really excited about that. I'm really excited about the lipstick. Obviously the skincare I'm super stoked about. The hair product, I mean, there's no option to be like, eh, kind of opt out of that. But I will try it. I am excited about trying it. They did have a living proof sample in the last box. And I don't want to like it as much as I like it because I just can't, I can't live that life of that expensive of a hair product. But I'm probably going to because it is, it is worth it. I really liked it. So I think they did a good job curating this box for me this month. I'm excited. How'd you guys feel about this video? Did you get any useful info? Um, I'm going to put, I'm going to uh, list all the makeup that I am wearing today in the description box down below. I'm also going to go on Sephora's website and see if I can get prices for all the full sizes of these products. Just in case, you know, you got this box as well, you're interested in purchasing the larger size and you want to see how much it's going to cripple you financially because they do have really good products at Sephora, obviously. So if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you like the video if you did enjoy it. Leave a comment down below. Did you get your box yet? What did you think? What items did you get that I didn't get? Um, what items do you wish that they would put in the Sephora play box? Uh, hit the bell for all notifications of my further uploads. And let me know, is there any hair, makeup, skincare videos that you guys would like to see? Would you like to see these videos discussed, you know, makeup discussed along with a horror movie review perhaps? Because I would be into that. I've been thinking about doing maybe like a get ready with me while I'm discussing a horror movie because these are my passions people makeup and horror movies and tiny cats and she's around here somewhere but I don't know you can also follow me on Facebook at Reanimator Reviews and on Twitter at Reanimator and I thank you guys so much for joining me today enjoy your play box <laughs>